Hi and welcome to a very special edition of Night of the Jumps here from the Koenigs Pilsner Arena in Oberhausen, Germany. Normally at Night of the Jumps, it is rider versus rider, man against man. It's an individual competition in freestyle motocross. This weekend, however, it will be a little bit different. It is the World Team Championship, with nations battling it out to see who will be the champion at the end of the night. For the very first World Team Championship at Night of the Jumps, we will have three teams going head to head. The first team, of course, will be the host nation, Germany. Featuring Hannes Ackermann, he's one of the old dogs from Germany. He's been there almost from the start of freestyle motocross in Germany. And of course his younger brother, Luke Ackermann. And at the moment, Luke is absolutely on fire with some of the biggest tricks and also taking wins at the Night of the Jumps World Championships. And of course, the third rider will be the rookie, Christian Kleiner. He just won the Flight Club in 2017. It's an amateur competition in Germany. So let's see what he can do on the world stage. So let's have a look now at Team Czech Republic. And first up, the captain, Libor Podmol. He is our former 2010 world champion. And he's one of those riders that basically, if a trick's been done, Libor can do it, including that huge vault. Team Czech Republic will be bolstered by the experience of Martin Corrin. He's been there and done it all in the European freestyle motocross scene. But also for Team Czech Republic, they'll have the enthusiasm of the young blood, Matej Cezak, the third rider to come out. He is the new kid on the block. He's ridden one night of the jumps event before, so he's got a little bit of experience on what it's like to ride in front of a big crowd. And will it be enough for him to show all of his big tricks here tonight? Taking a look now at Team Overseas, it's basically the Southern Hemisphere taking over. From Australia, Ryan Brown, he will start out the competition. He's only just broken on to the international scene, but he's come with some of the biggest tricks, including that ruler flip. I can't wait to see him throw that down in front of the German crowd. Pat Bowden is really on fire at the moment. He's got some of the biggest tricks in the game, including that rock solid backflip. And he's also picked up a whole host of trophies from Night of the Jumps in 2017. The final rider out for Team Overseas will be Javier Villegas from Chile. It's been a long time since we've seen Javier at Night of the Jumps. He was our 2011 former world champion, so he knows exactly what to do to impress the judges. But how will he work in a team environment such as the trains and the synchro competitions? The new World Team Championship will be broken up into five different disciplines and it would not be a Night of the Jumps competition without our regular freestyle motocross competition. It will be seven jumps plus the double up for the riders to throw down their biggest trick and get double the points. One of the disciplines that is very well known at Night of the Jumps is the Max's Best Whip competition where two riders from each team will throw their bikes upside down, back to front and inside out for the crowd's pleasure. The synchro competition will be absolutely spectacular with two riders from each team going side by side performing the exact same trick. Not only do they have to think about the timing of the trick, also the difficulty going into it, as well as getting tangled up with each other side by side landing on the same jump. One of the disciplines where the teamwork will really come into play is the trains. With all three riders from each team going out and performing all of the tricks, they don't have to actually do the same trick. All three riders will have the potential to throw down any trick that they wish, as long as it keeps the crowd excited and also the judges. The last discipline it doesn't need very much explanation at all. It is best trick. One rider from each team, they have two chances to throw down their biggest tricks and the best trick will win. The new World Team Championship promises to be one hell of a night. Now let's go inside and find out who has the strongest team.